Hey, I'm back, and I've built windows. Look at these things. Beautiful. Anyway, in this episode, I was gonna build a farm and also go mining. I don't know. Just a bunch of random things. Oh, what the... My camera. <laughs> my, what's happening? Okay, I think we're good. But anyway, I was gonna build a wheat farm. I actually forgot to make a bed, so... I'm gonna actually shear the sheep first. How many is that? One. Okay, I'll have to shear the other. Alright, time to get some wood for these fences. I could use spruce wood, but I just like using oak wood a bit more. Also, I've been a bit sick recently, so bear with me here if I sound a bit weird on the mic. But I've been I've been getting better, so it shouldn't sound that off at all. All right, this last tree could break my axe. I don't know, but oh, it did. All right, so that'll be the last tree I need. I've gotten a ton of trees anyway, so I have plenty of wood. Ooh, an apple. Uh, I'll store this here for now. These last fences should do it. All right. Uh, next up is the torches. Then I have to actually add the water and plants. Infinite water source. Or, or not? What? Okay. Well, infinite water source now. Okay, and done. Alright, that's the wheat farm done. I'll be adding more farms in the future, but that's our basic food supply for now. Uh, anyway, there's a traveling merchant that showed up. Alright, let's see his useless trades. Like, what is- okay. Beetroot seeds I might want, but like, the rest of this? What, e what even is this? Like, what the heck is the point of this? Time to go mining in this cave that I found near my house. Uh, hopefully it's a good one. Uh, there's some iron here, so... That should be a good sign, hopefully. This cave sucks, it literally went nowhere. At least I got some decent iron out of it, but nothing else really. I'm probably just gonna build um, an actual mine right by my house or something. Just so that it's easier and I don't have to actually look for a cave anywhere. Just gonna dig straight down here. Gonna add some ladders and provide some quick access to the mine. Now I have to dig out a little room just to start in, you know. Maybe add some chests down here or something. I don't know. This could become a full-on basement, but I think I'm going to move out of the little shack anyway. Ooh, iron. Alright. That's pretty nice. Torch. 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 Okay, now I can actually start the mine. Uh, I usually just build a little staircase and... I make like a staircase down to bedrock and then I go back up to like level 10 or so I don't know just to get to a common layer for diamonds okay I've just about hit bedrock now I've hit bedrock okay it's time to go back up to like level 10 or so and try and look for some diamonds all right just gonna start oh all right so a lava pit within two blocks imagine I find diamonds already that would be kind of weird I don't know if this is lava pit or a full-on cave. Could be. I see a little thing over there. I don't know, though. I'm gonna get this redstone first, though. So it's not actually a cave, and there's no diamonds over here. It's just a little edge of this. But I'm gonna keep looking for diamonds anyway over here. For mining, I use um, a little technique just to get as much area as possible. I don't know if there's any better ones. It's just the one that I've always used. 
where you dig out a really long tunnel over here and then place a torch like if you need to see or something. I should probably turn my brightness up just so that I can actually see what's over there and I don't need to place torches. But you just dig these big long one block tunnels over here and you can find stuff like that because you can cover a lot of surface area. So it's pretty useful. I don't know if there's any better ones, but this is just the one that I use. I've been mining for a while. No luck on diamonds, but I'll take this coal though, because I've been running kind of low on it. Sometimes it can take a very short amount of time for me to find diamonds. Sometimes it can take me like up to an hour, and I don't know why. It just It's just your luck, really. Oh, Lapis, why? Uh, that's annoying. This is taking forever. Like, I've had to go through multiple sets of pickaxes. I had to smelt some of the iron I found to make new pickaxes. Like, this is really take. Oh. Well, <laughs> there it is. <laughs> uh, finally. So, let's just see how many this is. I think it's five. It could be more. At least it wasn't one or two. Okay, we got six. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. So, we have six, maybe seven, maybe? No, no, no. We got six, so that's nice. And time to head back and see what to do with these. It was taking so long, too, to find these things, man. Uh, I'm glad that I finally found them, but I think that'll actually be it for this video. Next video, I'm planning on making things like farms, maybe. Possibly going to the nether, but I don't really know. So, I'm just going to get to smelting this stuff, and thank you guys for watching.